Hello mis amigos and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing great. I hope you're having an amazing day. And today, I'm here with my partner in crime, Chili. Chili, what do you have to say to this? Yeah. I hear our prime suspect is erasing himself from this narrative, but if anything changes, I'll make sure to let you know. Now back to the studio. Thank you very much. I don't even know. I don't even know what's happening to be honest, but I feel like we all don't really know what's happening. Like, what even is happening? All I know, <laughs> all I know is that Chili just really wanted to try new kitchen gadgets because he's like, I'm kind of bored in the kitchen. I need some new cool stuff that would make my life a little bit easier and hopefully a little bit more fun. So I went onto the interwebs for him and I searched and I searched and it took me forever to find something, but eventually I did find something and then it took forever for this something to arrive here with us. He's been very, very patient, so I think it's time to finally try out more kitchen gadgets. Questionable kitchen gadgets. I really have no idea what this intro was, but you get the gist. We're gonna try more kitchen gadgets. Are you ready? Are you ready? Then hop, settle up. What is going on? Oh. So the first thing that we're gonna try, I'm really excited about because it's something that I don't really love but I'm okay eating. And I haven't eaten it in forever because it involves meat, which I do no longer eat. Ah, but we'll make it without meat so that I can eat it. I found this hot dog maker. It just looks really exciting and super easy. So I really want to try out this hot dog maker and hope that it'll make my hot dog life a little bit easier. Let's open this bitch up. Chili, are you ready for a hot dog? A hot dog? <laughs> Yoohoo! Instructions. Ah! So it looks a bit like a toaster, but it says party time, and I think it's party time. Okay, read these instructions before you Anyway, okay. I am extremely, extremely sad to report that my partner is gone. He ran away. Chili. Oh, fine, then I'll just make myself a hot dog. You'll get none of this dog. Damn, <laughs> calm your farm. I mean, I guess it's really straightforward. You just put everything in and turn this bad fish off. This smells very chemical and definitely not like something I would want to put my hot dogs into or any kind of food really, but it's just what we're gonna have to do now. It tells me to open the bun and place it inside of this. Now let's place my vegetarian sausage in this hole. Let's just do it, okay? Not gonna lie, it's kind of unnecessary, right? It's not that hard to heat up the sausages and the hot dogs. Also, you can only do two at a time, so it's not really great for a party time. <gasps> I don't know why you have to be so loud. Wait, are you burning? Stop, how about stop? <laughs> do I have pickles? Oops. Yeah. It's not that hot anymore. Mmm. Damn, what a taste sensation. Yeah, I guess it does its job. I can't complain. It's good, it's nice, it's warm. It's very unnecessary, as I said. It's not a hard job to heat up the sausages and the buns. But if you're too lazy to do that, then that's great. And it's party time, you know? Who wants a hot dog? Eesh. Yummy hot dog? Sure. Another hot dog for the hungry people in the back. <laughs> Wait, what did I get this for then? Bon appetit. Thank you. Mmm. Mm. Okay, it's dry. It can be placed right here for whenever you feel like you need a hot dog in your life. Well, it will bother you more than me. <laughs> Good news, everyone. My co-anchor is back. This out of the way. My co-anchor wants to fight with me. Oh, he wants to leave me. Guess I'll get rid of this chair again. And let's move on to the next gadget. 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 So recently, it has come to my attention that people, especially Naomi, <laughs> 
struggle a lot peeling garlic. So I searched for something that would make that process a little easier. And apparently I found something. But looking at it, I don't think I really found something. Because what I've got here is this silicone garlic thingy that is supposed to peel the garlic, but really it's... Ah. Yeah, I don't know. Let's just put garlic in it and what am I supposed to do? Like, there are no instructions. I guess I'm just stupid and there are not supposed to be instructions because it's clear what you have to do, but... I don't know what to do. <laughs> ah. How's this supposed to work? I don't understand. I don't understand. Help me, internet. Help me. Help me. Like so. Awa! I guess it's doing the trick, but like I could also do it not in this thing. Yoohoo! They're gone. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. It's a scientific revolution. Maybe it's useful if you have like a lot of garlic and you need all of that garlic peeled. 10 out of 10. Wow, I love it. Moving on to hopefully something that's even more amazing. And for that, here we've got this beautiful straightening iron. And you're probably wondering, what are you doing with a straightening iron in the kitchen? Well, let me tell you this. Sometimes you have a package that is open and you need to seal it for it to still be fresh. You can do it with this amazing straightening iron. Hopefully, I mean, I haven't tried yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, love that European plug. Is it on already? Okay, let's turn it off first. I need to find something I have to seal. Uh, how about my soft dates? I could eat a date right now. Hey, my co-anchor, do you want a date? I would want a date. <laughs> this is what it looks like, by the way. I mean, it just looks like a straightened iron in green. <laughs> And white. Is it hot already? I mean, I'm guessing it's not supposed to be super hot, right? Wait, why did the light turn off? Does that mean it's hot enough? Bring it. Okay, this one doesn't work. <laughs> and we do that. For how long do I have to hold it like this? At this rate, when I'm done sealing it, I want to eat it again. Is this? What is this absolute trash? Oh, <laughs> it's no longer plugged in. <laughs> I mean, it's getting warm, but it's definitely not sealing in. Now it smells like burnt plastic, obviously. It's not sticking together. Who has the time? I give up. Trash! Maybe I can use you for my hair, but definitely not for sealing my stuff. Alrighty, let's hope the next kitchen gadget won't leave me as sad as the last one did. Actually, this one might leave me sad because with this kitchen gadget, I will prepare something that I don't even like eating, so... There's that. Because what we've got here is the ultimate Potato Express. So it's this bag, I don't even know. You're supposed to place one to four washed potatoes into Potato Express DM, then close the flap, cook it in the microwave for four minutes, and then it's done. I hope you want to eat potatoes, Naomi. I wash the potatoes, I'm gonna place them inside, close it, and I guess I'll see you guys in four minutes. All right, it's been four minutes. Let me tell you, it's steaming and it smells very much like potato. Hello, potatoes. They look old. <gasps> oh my God, what the fuck? They are so soft. <laughs> I mean, I'm not gonna try it now, will I? I don't know what to do with this now. <laughs> I mean, I touched it, it's working. Because I feel like the problem with potatoes for many people, which is also one of the reasons, it's one of the three ingredients that I absolutely hate, they just take forever to cook. This was four minutes, and I'm pretty sure they would have been done after three as well, so that's pretty cool. It's cooked! <laughs> now we've looked at Three, four beautiful gadgets, but I think it's time for one more. Oops. Ha ha ha! Look at this! Oh, 
Look at this. I got this super cool candy arcade, which it's not necessarily a kitchen gadget, but I think it has something to do with food, as in sweets and candies. So really, it is a kitchen gadget. Am I right? Fun, fun action, action music, music just, just like, like the arcade. arcade. It's so, so much, much fun. fun. Once, Once you start, you just, just can't stop. stop. Beat the candy arcade before the music stops. <gasps> It's a competition? This looks amazing. I'm a bit afraid that I've got the wrong, or that I don't have the right, <laughs> batteries. <gasps> what are those? Why does it need these massive batteries? Let's hope that these are the right ones because I just walked an eternity to get them. Obviously I bought some candy just for this. That shall suffice, I think. I'm so excited for the music as well. So far, nothing is happening. <gasps> I have to put in the money. I'm kind of nervous and excited now. Let's do this. This is fucking scary. Oh my God, it's moving. Damn it, I need more money. Oh my god, why is this so loud anyway? We know that parties are not loud. <laughs> we're in lockdown. This is a party for just me, myself, and I. And also, I suck at this. I almost got it. Look, this one. Look, ah! No! Oh my god, I Do you have more money? It's not high enough, it's not high enough. You need to go out. I can't! Ah. Yeah. Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> I suck! <laughs> got it! Ooh, two at one! <gasps> I got an applause! Not gonna lie though, yes, the music is absolutely annoying and way too fucking loud, but I think this is actually fun. I think I'm gonna give this to my niece and nephews because this is fun. 10 out of 10, would definitely buy again. I feel like today was an extra interesting episode of trying kitchen gadgets because they were very, very questionable. I feel like my favorite one was the candy arcade because it's fun, totally fun. It's very fun. Oh, you can turn off the music. Cause I was gonna say, I turn off the music and just put on different music because that one was just not it. And it's very scary and super loud and just not it. I'm still absolutely offended about the straightening iron seal thingy. Absolutely surprised that this worked. You're probably not surprised but I'm still very surprised. The garlic thing, I don't know, I don't, questionable. And the hot dog maker is top notch. It did its job, I guess. I hope you still enjoyed and had some fun checking out these kitchen gadgets with me. If you know a place where there are more kitchen gadgets, if you want me to even try more kitchen gadgets, then definitely let me know because I feel like I haven't found the perfect kitchen gadget yet. All that's left for me to say is thank you guys so much for watching this video. Entonces, nos vemos la próxima vez. Y bye!